Good morning, this is Connie from WBUS Newsroom. Welcome back to everyone. Glad to, that you are all here. Hope you had a wonderful summer. Oh, breaking news is coming in. This just in. We have a reporter in the field with a special guest this morning. Now to you, Daisy, are you there? Yes, Connie, I'm here, thank you. I'm here with a very special guest today. She has visited many schools over the years and has talked about school bus safety. She is super sad that she's unable to visit the schools this year in person, but she still wanted to make sure that all the students heard the school bus safety message. Hello, Barney Sue. It's great to see you. That is you, right? It's really hard for me to tell with your mask on. So everyone has to wear a mask on the bus the whole time they're on the bus? Yes, that's correct. Everyone must wear a mask the whole time they're on the bus. Now, Barney Sue, you're the only one who wears a So Barney Sue, what time do the students need to be at their bus stop or their safety spot? They should be there at their safety spot five minutes before their pickup time. That way, if the bus is running a little early that day, you will be ready. So what do all those lights mean on your bus? So, Barney Sue, how do the students know when to get on the bus? Well, the driver will do hand signals to help with the students. Would you like me to help you with that, Barney Sue, to show the kids? Yes, please. Now, if you're a Barney Can pickup, which is the same side as the door, the driver will have her hand up and one hand on the horn. So then when she drops her arm, that means it's safe for you to get on the bus. If she happens to honk her horn, that means danger. So you need to look at her so she can tell you what to do. Now, if you're a Well, thank you so much, Barney Sue. So what you're telling me is even if I'm a right-hand pickup on the door side, I still have to wait for the bus driver to tell me when to get on the bus. That's correct. Okay. Is there any special instructions for the railroad crossings, Barney Sue? 
that driver will let you know when you are going to cross the railroad. And it is very important that you always follow the directions of the bus driver. They will let you know that it is time for no noise. And they have other stuff they have to do at the tracks. But one of them that is most important is to listen for a train. So, everyone has to be very quiet so the driver can listen. So that's pretty important to be quiet at the railroad tracks when the driver tells you. Are there some other things that students are not allowed to do on the bus or while they're getting off or on the bus? Yes, Daisy, there is no eating or drinking on the bus. Plus they have masks on. How would they do that anyway? <laughs> oh yeah, when the students are getting on and off the bus, they cannot be playing on any type of electronic or have headphones or earbuds in their ears, even if they are off. Barney Sue, what you're telling me is there's no eating or drinking on the bus. Everybody has to have on a mask and no earbuds or headphones or any kind of electronics while we're getting on and off the bus. That's correct. Is there anything else that you would like to add, Barney Sue? The danger zone is very important to know about. You have to stay 10 steps away from the bus at all times. As you see, the bus is very big and the bus driver has some areas they cannot see. If you stay 10 steps away from the bus, they will be able to see you. Also, I want to remind everyone to follow the bus driver's directions. They are there to get you to and back home as safe as possible. Thank you so much, Barney Sue, for joining us today. I hope you have a safe school year. Thank you for helping me. <laughs> this is Daisy Driver reporting for WBUS News. Okay, thank you very much, Daisy. This was a great report. So to recap on what they all went through, everyone must wear a mask the whole time they are on the bus. There is no eating and drinking on the bus. You're supposed to be at your bus stop or your safety spot on time. Please stay 10 steps away from the bus at all times. Follow the bus driver's hand signals. No noise at the railroad tracks. Stay in your assigned seat. Keep the aisle clear. There to be no headphones or earbuds or electronics of any kind when you are getting on and off the bus. Follow the bus driver's directions. Be kind to each other, be respectful, be responsible, be safe. Hope you have a great school year. This is Connie, signing off for WBUS.